Organizers say that plunge will be back at its original location once construction's complete. Tonight, Toledo's first baby born in 2019, catching on some much needed rest. The five pound bundle of joy born at ProMedica. Ida Zadesco met up with the family of this little star today and found out why the timing of the birth came as a shock to the parents in more ways than one. Meet Sophie Lynn Vinette, Toledo's first baby born in 2019. I was very shocked. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a false alarm. I was just, thought it was too early. A month too early to be exact. After finishing up some last minute shopping for baby Sophie earlier in the day, mom Tabitha Kasak and fiance Michael Vinette stopped by his parents' house for New Year's dinner, where her contractions began and didn't let up for almost five hours. I'm up here about 11.30 and then it was just, I was expecting to be sent home. But after tests showed a few issues with Sophie's heart rate, doctors performed an emergency C-section and delivered Sophie at 1.15 in the morning. Walked in, she was laying there and all my stress just kind of went out of my feet. Like I was, it was a good feeling. A good feeling mom and dad deserve after the miscarriage of their baby before getting pregnant with Sophie. This was her little keepsake I got. Or his. Mm -hmm. She's yeah. our little. So she's our rainbow baby. Rainbow. Mm -hmm. And baby Sophie isn't the only member of their family to be a New Year firstborn. So my mom, she was a New Year's baby. Yeah. Which makes it even cooler because it's that's one of the first things I tell people about her when I talk about my mom. Just because it's, it's really interesting. And perhaps one day, it'll be one of the first things little Sophie's future child tells people about her. Reporting in Toledo, Ida Tedesco, WTOL 11. A man trying to steal a bicycle caught red-handed.